I'm Ashley Van Houten. I'm the products editor for Hospitality Design Magazine. And I'm here today with Lee Blair, president of Durkin, at their booth at HD Expo. Hi, Lee. Pleasure to see you today. Ashley, how are you? Very good, thank you. Good. So, first, if you could just give us an overview of Durkin and who you are and what you do. Okay, sure. Durkin was uh, founded in 1979 by Tom Durkin. Durkin was really the first uh, uh, carpet company to, to devote themselves to hospitality, primarily to the interior design community. You know, the styles and the looks in hospitality and the trends are really driven by the interior design community. So we're, we're a leader from the beginning, uh, dedicated to design. We've refocused ourselves on design over the last couple of years. Uh, we brought on Mark Page, uh, who we'll be speaking to uh, today as well, to head up our design efforts a year ago. We've made some great uh, leaps in the last year in, uh, in, in new looks, which we have on the, on the floor here today and on the walls. And we continue to focus on design uh, leadership through uh, understanding trends, uh, uh, being on the front end of color and design. Great. So let's take a walk and uh, check out the electronics technology. Okay, great. So last year, your big news was the Spectronics HD printing technology. Can you tell us how that's been going and where you see it going in the future? Sure, Ashley. We're, we're a little over a year and a half into the manufacturing process, really a, a little over a year into to understanding the design ability of the Spectronics 25X. I, I liken it to taking the, uh, the, the vividness and the uh, detail from an old television technology to high definition technology. If you could take a look at what we have on the wall here, uh, this, this is a photograph of a flower and we're able to take uh, the technology with two and a half, about two and a half times the, the uh, ability of, of pixelation of our uh, uh, previous technology and we're able to simulate uh, a real flower. We can do this type of uh, assimilation uh, from uh, design and we can create very, very sharp lines and detail of design and all of the products that are on the floor and in the booth, Mark Page will be talking about some of that a little later, you'll be able to take a look at what we've been able to achieve, but we're able to achieve Axminster type looks uh, with our print technology and it's really taking us and elevating us to an entirely different level. We thank you very much for speaking with us today, I appreciate Thanks, it. Ashley. And now we're off to speak with Mark Page, the Senior Director of Color and Design. So I'm here with Mark Page, Durkin Senior Director of Color and Design. Mark, thank you very much for Hi. being here. Nice to meet you, Ashley. Great. So can you tell me a bit about your booth this year? This year, I, I'm new to the, to the company. I've been on board nine months. We're trying to make some huge changes to the business. Uh, focused on design, leading by design. This year, what we're trying to do is, is create a collection. We've created a collection that, that focuses on the younger interior design uh, community. It's uh, based on Japanese tie-dye. Shibori. Um, what we've tried to do is incorporate denim type colors and, and focus a collection on a sort of a young American, uh, a reference to the past, but also a reference on the future. Um, for a first, I think, for Mohawk and for, for Durkin, we actually allowed ourselves people to wear denim. Uh, again, to tie ourselves into the specifying community and to tie in with the collection, which has been quite successful. The, the collection itself is. Um, made up of very, very large overscale designs. We have a custom synthesis background, which is a proprietary technology to Durkin. Uh, it's a cut and loop technology. Um, it creates on our 25 DPI printer, 25 colors, but with a cut and loop effect, it gives us effectively um, 24 colors, twice as many as, as 12. Very dramatic effect, uh, very bold, gotten some great praise from um, the community that has come by and seen the booth. All right, well, let's go take a look at some of the other collections. Great, lovely. So, again, this year you've renewed your partnership with Esther Dunbar Cullum. Sure. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah, it, it's part of, part of the theme that I want to focus on as Durkin. Um, generally viewed in the industry as being a sort of commodity floor covering. We're really not. We're, we're designers behind the scenes. We um, start with raw sketch material. We build it through to a, to a collection. Esther Dunbar um, was one of the original collaborators in the industry um, back in the old Tom Durkin days before Durkin was bought by Mohawk. Um, and that relationship ended around about 2000. Um, the intent was to bring them back in to uh, give us a reference on the past, also to help to promote the, the idea of hand-painted sketches, which is what Esther creates.